Now let's take a look at document settings. This is a very exciting new feature with XR7. And let me demonstrate. If we head up here to File, you're probably already familiar with this option here called 1CNC Properties. Let me explain what this is first quickly. This is just the ability to set up the defaults for your 1CNC software. So every time you launch the software, 1CNC is going to use these properties. But what's new to XR7 and what's very exciting is there's a new option here called Document Settings. Now what Document Settings does is it provides the ability to set up settings or defaults for this particular part file. So once you save this part file, when you load this part file up a week from now, a month from now, two years from now, 1CNC is going to load these settings up. You have control over your text, your dimension style, and your colors as well. All right, now let's elaborate a little bit on the dimension side of things. XR7 now brings forward the ability to select different styles. You can select whatever style you want. Also notice quickly within XR7, there's a brand new arrow type, which is open arrow. And also notice XR7 provides the ability now to set the size of your arrow using dimensions. In past versions of 1CNC, this was a percentage of the text height. So some great new additions to the CAD side of 1CNC, and this happens to be one of them. This is the ability to set up defaults for your part file. Okay, and so that's called document settings. Very, very nice new command.